Hi everyone, this is Judy from Judy's Handmade Creation. And if you haven't subscribed, do so. Hit the bell so when I upload a video, you'll be notified. These wood plants I got from the Dollar Tree. And you get six of them in there. And I guess the size of them are about... Wait, let me see. They're about seven inches wide by two and three-fourth inch and those three inches but I got these from the Dollar Tree store I'm gonna do paint them and then stencil on top of them I got those I got this little wooden tray that I'm gonna paint and then stencil in, on the ends and stencil some words on the inside that's from the Dollar Tree store. It's wooding. And this is about 7 inches long by 5 and five and 3 eighths wide from side to side. I got this. And I got a, a si embossing Silas. So I can emboss in my paper. I already opened it. And it embosses your paper. Like does dense. Like if you're doing flowers and you want to make it look like they're going to pop up. You can use this. That was a dollar. And then I got one of these. Little hardware storage cases. That was a dollar at the dollar store. Maybe I'm going to decorate the outside and put some um, embellishments like beads and stuff on the inside. Got that for a dollar. And then I also got this organizing case. I got that one. That was a dollar. You can also put your buttons or something, your craft supply, like and uh, gems and all in here. You could probably decorate this too at the top. Got that for a dollar at the Dollar Tree store. I got this binder, three, three ring binder. It was a dollar. It was at the dollar store, and this is a very small binder. And it's got like little pockets on the inside. And this little binder is about seven inches wide by, I guess that's eight and three four four quarters tall. So it's a pretty small one. Maybe I'll do like a planner with it. So I got that for a dollar at the Dollar Tree store. And I got these little artist canvas panels. You get two of these for a dollar where I can do more stenciling. On it. These came from the Dollar Tree store too. And you get two of these for a dollar. It says 100% natural co cotton canvas. Excellent for oil and acrylic paint. I'm going to paint them and then I'm going to stencil on top. So I got these from the Dollar Tree store. And I got these self-adhesive stencils. That I'll be using for my wood projects or canvases or whatever. And these are, that's a fox owl. I guess that's a raccoon and a bird. And these are pretty nice stencil stickers, I think. And these are from the Dollar Tree store. And they're cute. I like to do a lot of stenciling. 
make up a lot of gifts or craft items for the church to sell. And here's more self-adhesive stencils that I got from the Dollar Tree store. I like these because it's a lot of words. It says, Hello Sunshine, Love and Happiness, Do What You Love, What You Do. And it says, Daydream and Love. And I'm going to be doing some more stencils. St stencil painting with those. And I got these. This cute little bag. These are cosmetic bags that I got. This is like a blue color. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to take the We Are Memory Freestyle full quill pen and I'm going to try to put a design on here and then stuff it with some goodies and send to one of my daughter's friends for a birthday and then I also got on the pink one I'm going to do the same with this one these are cosmetic bags and they're pretty nice and these were from the Dollar Tree store. And this is like a pink color. It's got a lot of glitter. It's like a glittery look. And it's got a nice zipper on it. You can put all the stuff in here that you're going to give to someone. For a birthday or something. Wrap it up. Gift card, makeup, or whatever. And I'm going to do the same with this one. I'm going to take the, the freestyle quill pen where it puts gold or silver letters or a design or something on here. I'm going to do that with this. So I got two of these. And I got some pot mitts that I'm going to fill with some stuff. And maybe give it as a gift. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to stencil something up here. With, I'm going to do some stencil painting. And this is a, a pot mat. You can put your pot on top of it or whatever. You can hang it. And it'd be nice with something up here like a stencil painting. I got this one. This is a gray one. And I got this from the Dollar Tree store too. These are really nice. And you can always stuff up some more kitchen um, kitchen tools that you use in the kitchen in here. And like I said, I'm going to stencil on top of this one. And I also got this from a blue one. I'm going to do the same with this one. I'm going to um, take and stencil over top, top of here, stencil painting. Pick out a stencil that I want, and then I'm going to stuff it with some more utensils, tools for the kitchen in here. And then I'm going to give it as a gift. And these are pretty nice. Really nice looking. And these are really good. This this haul here is from the Dollar Tree store. And I got some stuff from Walmart I'll be showing. So this is the end of the Dollar Tree store. Okay. This, this haul here is from Walmart. And I got these water ba watermelon bath bombs from Walmart yesterday when I went and I got these for my daughter because she likes the bath bombs and it's got five in there I think I paid like three dollars and something for them 347 something like that so I got these from Walmart and I got these um 20 piece squares. They're five, five inch by five inch 
5 inch by 5 inch squares to 100% cotton. I'm going to do something with those. And it's got a lot of nice designs in there. I don't know, my camera ain't focusing. There it goes. I got these from Walmart. And it's real pretty. Real pretty, um, 5 inch by 5 inch squares. And this is cotton. And these were $4.97. I'm going to do something with these. And I got this here. I already opened it because I want to open it in the store. I just threw the pack. It's Home Sweet Home. It's a cross stitch kit. And it comes with everything you need to get. The kit includes thread, 14 count, Ada fabric, hoop, needle, and easy instructions. I got one of these. I just opened it and wanted to see how it was. And I got this from Walmart. So I got that to work on. And I got some more hot glue sticks from Walmart. I never tried these. It says Bonds wood, metal, glass, plastic, floral, fabric, leather, foam, and more. I think these were like seven something. And you get 75 in there. That's all that it bonds together down at the bottom. I never tried this brand, so I got these. And that's the back of it. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of blurry. And it tells you you can use it for a high temp gun or a low temp gun. So these came from Walmart. They were 7 I think they were $7.97. And I got some eight more 8x10 eight canvas. These are from Walmart. It's a three pack and these were $2.97. I like to do keep a lot of these. I keep a lot of these on hand so when I want to do stencil one or if I want to make some things for the um, church craft fair and donate them to them. I um, have a lot of these so I can make up stuff and they can make a profit to help the church out. Okay, I got those. You get three in there for $2.97. And they had these little these little um storage boxes here. I thought maybe I can decorate the front and then put some stuff in here. Decorate you can decorate both sides because this is you can open it here and you can open it down at the bottom. So you got two ways you can open this. So you can Decorate both sides with some paper or fabric or whatever. And fill it with some stuff and give to one of your pen pals or something. So you can decorate both sides of these. You got this side that you can put stuff in and you got this side that you can put stuff in. And this was a dollar at Walmart. I thought that was pretty cool. They had a whole bunch there but I only got one just to try it out. And then I got some, this is lightweight stabilizer. This is for my um, embroidery sewing machine. I use this to put designs on my um, t-shirts and sweatshirts that I, that I embroider with my uh, sewing machine embroidery. It's an Apoclique. So you can make your app leaks to go and your embroidery designs. So I got this. It's mid-weight to heavyweight fabrics that you can use it on. This is what you put in the back and then you take your sewing machine and put your design on the 
front of the t-shirt so it stabilizes doing stitching your design so I got this for that and I got some heat and bond this was from Walmart this is to create my fabric um, patches that I aren't on. I can put this on the back of it. Like if I cut out a um, butterfly with my Big Shot Plus machine, I can take and put this on the back of it and then just iron it on my um, jeans or t-shirt or whatever. So this is no sew. And this is great for fabric patches, denim, leather, suede, appliques. I had to get some more of this. I got that from Walmart. And I also got two packs of these. These are adhesive magnetic strips. And you just break them apart. These are, I got this one open. You get three of them, so it's 18. You get 18 of them in here, and they're half inch. I don't know if you can see it, half inch by four inches long. They're four inches this way, and then you just break them apart, and it'll be a half inch. You break them from half inches. So I got these for some of my to create some magnets. I got two packs of these. I open that pack. Okay, I got those. They were 97 cents at Walmart. And I got these little wooden circles. I forgot how much these were. But you get six of them in here, and I got these at Walmart. These wooden circles. I'm going to do something with them. Maybe I'll make a magnet with it or I'm going to paint them and then maybe decorate the front maybe stencil something on front or whatever and then make it into a magnet these are I don't know how many inches big these are but I got these how many oh these are like three and a quarter diameter around and you get six of these I got these at Walmart and I also got some more of these sheets, some more heavyweight sheet protectors. And I use these for my I use these to make my shaker pockets. Shaker pads and shaker cards or whatever. So that's one. I use these little clear, clear, um, sheets. Or you can use the other stuff that I'm getting ready to show you that they got. I got this at Walmart. I think these were $4.90 some, $4.97. And I got these here to do, um, pocket letters with. I needed some more of these. These are, you get 10 pages. And I'm going to do, oh, I've got that on there. You see where it's already, where you can put your, your cards in there. You can do your little cards and just slip them in there and you can send them to your pen pal. I got these. Okay, and I also got, I got another roll of this because I like to use this for my, um, I like to use this for my crafts. I like to use them for my books. It says great for crafting, great for crafts, and surfacing projects. For surfacing projects and, um, adhesive. It's an adhesive laminate, laminate, and I like it because you can just, if you want to decorate a book or something or a journal, 
this is good because you can use this over top of your journals and I had this kind before so I got another roll of this they got all different kinds there and this is this is one with flowers on it I like this one here so I got this I think this was I can't remember how much it was sometimes I forget how much everything is but I got this at Walmart it says Walmart at the bottom. I don't know if you can see it, but see I got it at Walmart. And I like it. It's nice. Adhesive laminating. You just stick it on your book or your craft or whatever, your journal. And it's good. I like that. Got that from Walmart. And I got I got some some of this uh this is not leather. I don't know what you call it. Um I got some of this, I'm gonna do something with it. Either use it for a book or something like that outside of a book and I got I don't know I guess this is like a yard I think that's what I told her I wanted got this here I got that color because I like that one and I don't know I lost the ticket on that one that lady uh, I didn't see the ticket I forgot how much it was too I don't know they got it at Walmart if I don't know. I don't know if all of them got it, but mine's got it. It's like a leather. But it's not leather. It's a it looks like leather, but it's not. And I got this one here. This one I still got the ticket on it. This one was $349. And I think this is like a half a yard. I think I got like a half a yard. This was $349. And it's like a leather. It's like a leather piece, but I got too close. You can't see it. It's like leather, too. I got that. And I got black, because I like to use black. I got this one. This is like it looks like leather, but it's not. And this, I think, this is a half a yard too. I think I got all half a yards because I just wanted to try it out. It's not leather; it just looks like it. And I got this. I forgot how much this was because I lost the ticket on it. I probably kept it in my bag and threw it away. But this one here was three forty nine. It's not that much money. I got that at Walmart. And then I also got, never had one of these before. And I wanted to try this out. They had this there. I think this was $19.97. It's a speedy stitcher. It includes the sewing all. It says a diamond point straight and curved stainless needle and the 30 spool of wax polyester thread and instructions. This is easy to open. Uh oh, okay, you get your your spool of you get your spool here and you get your your thread. Let me see. Let me see where the needles is. I think there's all your needles are in here. Oh, that's good. You store them in there. You get a curved needle. And you get a straight needle. That's good that they store inside there. I wanted to try this out. And you get you get the um it opens up here i have to figure it out it said needles 
store it inside handles. Oh, okay. That way you won't end up losing your needles. I don't know, it's so cleary. I don't know my, I don't know if you can see the back of this. There it goes. It says leather goods, saddle tack, canvas tarp, climbing, camping gear, athletic gears. I don't know, I thought I would try this, the speedy stitcher out. It's called a speedy stitch sewing all kit. An indispensable tool to help you sew or repair. Okay, that's good. And you also get the directions how to use it. It's called the sewing app all directions and it's got this so this will probably show much of how to do it I don't know I thought it'd be good to have this so something I can't sew on a sewing machine I can use this to sew it with so that's got all it shows you from one that's one two three or four five and then you go on the back it's got six uh, seven eight and then you got nine and ten it shows you how to put it together and stuff because some things you can't sew with your sewing machine I think this would be handy for things that you can't sew It says, great for heavy leather, denim, or canvas. Oh, that's good. I better put this in here because I don't know how to use it. So, uh, that's about... Oh, I got one more thing to show you that I got. Let me put this up here. I'm going to put this back in here if I can get it back in there. But that's the... Speedy Stitch Sewing On. Then I got this from Walmart. Yep, that's where I got this from. I think it would be good. This is a good tool, I think, to have. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So, that way, if you want to get one, you know where to get it from. Walmart. Okay, I also got one item from from Michaels. Let me grab it. And it's a big. Since I use so much of this heating bond, I got a big one. I had went there and seen this. I think this was like ten or eleven dollars. Instead of buying them little ones, you get more with this. It says five yards, so I make a lot of patches. So this is the no sew, no sew fabric pouch denim, and this is all the stuff I got. All the stuff that I have here I got from the Dollar Tree in one group, Dollar Tree store, and then Walmart and other group, and then the one item I got from Michaels. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my haul. I hope you enjoyed everything I showed you. And I got a lot of nice stuff that I purchased from Walmart and all. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so.
and I want to say thank you for watching my videos and thank you for subscribing have a blessed day bye bye